sales entry how to make a sale it means how to make a invoice so that is you can click transaction and sales billing you can select the sales billing and you can select your customer here that is not important if you are making the counter sale or cash sale direct cash sale there is not important for the party selection customer selection but if you are making the credit sale compulsory you need to select a party you can search here your available customers will be listed here if that is new customer you can click it here in the plus button there is all customer list you can click here new and you can create the new customer here the customer address name id you can fill it and create it here so in my case i select this customer so the customer present outstanding will be displayed here it's very nice i am selecting for another customer if there is any outstanding it will be displayed here and any reference for example quotation number or lpo number any another reference if there is have you can fill it here otherwise not important in my condition lpo sorry lpo this is lpo number i just mentioned and the date for example the invoice date that's normally it, it will come the same day if you want change there is option also and the employee which employee making this sale because you have employee wise incentive or something your salesman wise any commission discount anything you can select here otherwise it will be default employee in my case i select the joseph this is the employee and which price list you can select i'll go another video about the detail about the price list now we can go as a retail price normally as a retail price and i'm going to select the item microsoft optical mouse i select here you know automatically here will show what is the available stock for the item whenever you search the item here will show the available quantity you have 189 in this bill you are going to make three items you are going to sell as a three piece and there is option also you it automatically here will be display the as you set the pre present price list if you have permission to change the pricing there is option also but your admin need to provide the permission for you to the change rates so whenever you are making the sales as per the discussion you can possible to change the price for example i am going to sell as a 18 plus tax so it will be 18 so total three piece will be 54 and 54 plus tax will be 5.4 so 59.4 is automatically in my case i want to sell as a three pieces 55 plus tax i want to sell so directly i can enter for the excluded tax i am entering 55 so it will be reverse calculated one piece will be 18.33 automatically is reverse calculated you don't want to calculate by manually for one piece right system will calculate automatically so it will be 18.33 total with tax will be 16 60.5 so on the condition maybe you need 55 you want to sell this one as 55 included vat all tax included you want to make 55 amount because you can select here for example in the total included tax 55 so this totally reverse calculated one piece right will be 16.667 and total will be 50 uh, without the tax will be 50 and plus 5 will be tax 55 it will be rounded correctly and there is one option also if you are selling this item as below cost system will notify you i will show you like that i can check uh, this cost also from here for example when i am searching the item here you can understand your cost this is your cost so i want to sell as a below cost for example 11 i want to sell you know here will system will remind you ended price less than cost but you can make the sales but system will remind you you are going to lose for this Uh, this product you are selling for as a loss so in my case i am selling for 60 total three pieces 60 and i'll sell another one item also for example xerox sorry a4 sheet sorry a4 paper i want to sell as a one only i'm going to sell this one i want to sell as 2 okay and there is any discount like that you can give it here and there is one additional option also for example in this supplier sorry in this customer the particular item 
what are the rates you are sell you can just uh, just previous deal will be here so before you sell 44 in this date same customer you sold this item as a 22 now you are going to sell as a 18 point so the previous deal also you can check in the same window so the entry everything will be finished now i am going to save this entry so whenever you are clicking the save additional mode of payment option will be here how you are going to collect your money customer paying you direct cash you can select here cash and save if customer paying as a card or any bank transfer or check something you can select here bank and you can select the bank account if there is check post dated date you can select also and you can click save it will affect your bank reconciliation and bank statements and credit if the customer not pay anything customer is a credit customer you can click a credit if mixed also there is option so in my case this is credit customer not going to pay anything later on i will collect the money if there is any due date presently the due date will be 90 90 days if you can change also the due date for the if credit sale there is due date also you can change as per the customer discussion and you can click it save so the invoice will be appear here this is the tax invoice but there is lots of templates i'll show another one template here this is one template lots of templates will be here and you can customize also in the template because i'll show on another video how to customize the templates but here i'll show you lots of templates will be here lots of type lots lots of design will be here and you can directly print the template sorry print the invoice or you can make pdf excel also i'll show just one minute so this i i want to print i can just click print it will be print if i want to make this one as a pdf excel word it will be you can select here show toolbar so one to a toolbar will be appear here and i'll set for the page width for viewing for the completely so here from the export option i can make it excel or pdf word i can export also very easily if i want to make it as a pdf just click it here pdf i can and give the name and save it it will be as a pdf if i want to print this one just i can just click the print i can select my printer and i can print it also thank you for download www.acrobiz.com